How's your head? Okay, first off, I apologize. This isn't exactly protocol, but then again, what is right now, huh? You know? No, you don't. Um, I'm sorry, you know nothing. This is all new to you. Um, okay. Have you ever seen a spy movie? You're in a Protego safe house, not far from your home, and once again, I'm very sorry I brought you here. Under different circumstances, there'd be a more formal invite. Fewer black helicopters, we might get a beer. You know <laughs> what I mean? Okay, yeah, silent treatment, I get that. That makes sense, I deserve that, I deserve that. Let me be as frank as possible. You're here because we need your help. I work for Protego, all right? We're an independent spy network, multiple agencies working together. We salute no flag, we discriminate against no applicant. Our only mission, our sole mission is to protect the innocent. We're the good guys, okay? <laughs> We're the good guys. I'm an operator, Jim Ratio, Alpha Division. I coordinate agents in the field. At least I did, I used to. There's this guy, a dangerous man, right? He calls himself solitary. He disrupted our network, revoked my coordination rights to my team, my agents are in the field completely alone, blind. They do not know what's going on, and we don't know what Solitaire is up to, but we know it can't be good. But I have a workaround, all right? I pulled your name from a list of candidates. I don't know how you got there, but someone way higher up than me thinks you have something special. I brought you here because the system has no limits on new applicants. You can't write missions, but you can take them. If you can get to level 15 ranking, and I bet you can, then you can fix all of this. You'll earn that ranking by successfully completing missions using the Cyber Augmented Recon and Defense System. It's an abstract interface, but it'll help you get your spy crews in order. At level one, you can only command a single crew, the Mantis Group, and poof, they are messy, but they get the job done. As you progress, you'll unlock more crews, you'll take on bigger missions, you'll keep on going and leveling up and hopefully get us out of this. Good luck, Spy Master. I'll be with you every step of the way. Oh, and again, sorry about your head. Congratulations. Wasn't kidding about the Mantis group, right? I certainly wouldn't want to argue with them, because let me tell you, I tried once and it did not work out well. Blood Legacy, they're the old guard, right? They were here long before any of us were, and they seem pretty intent on outliving anyone 
who has the audacity to turn up later. Uh, they have the kind of uh, wealth and power you can only be born into. No, I get, I get that. I, I'm the same way. I don't like that. I'm not a fan of that. But like the Mantis folks, they have their uses. You'll have to access bigger jobs now, take them, and keep solitaire on the ropes. It's simple, Arith. Hey, be careful with Blood Legacy. Don't trust anything in our world that existed before you woke up. Really, any power that's been around that long, by definition, it's gonna be corrupt. Watch your back. Nice, you're doing it. You're figuring out how to play to the strengths of the different crews. It takes so many people so long to do that. All right, it's time I show you why I brought you here. Like I said, my whole team is locked out from crew commands thanks to Solitaire's attack, which means that right now you are the only spy master guiding Protego crews. And don't get me wrong, you're doing great. Real proud of you. That thing with the thing in the place, it was awesome. I've never seen Mantis and Blood Legacy work together so well. But Solitaire, all right? 
Solitaire will seize any opportunity he sees, and we need to be able to confront him on all vectors. At level 15, you can undo the crew lockout. You can assign control to whoever you want, and we can get Alpha Division back to work. It's the only way past the failsafe. And on the way there, you're gonna gain access to more crews and more crews and more crews and keep growing. Eyes on the prize, candidate. Let's take back the network. really gave you a choice, did I? That's your exit. You want to leave, you want to walk away, you want to go back to a normal life, that's okay. But if you stay, know that I've got your back. You're level four now, which means you can command Drive Team 6. They're extraction experts, real pros, top of the line. I hope you'll work with them to keep dismantling Solitaire's plans and leveling up, but if not, I'm sure they'll drive you home too. Remember what I said about trust, make up your own mind. Once you get to the next level, you're going to have access to four crews, which means you can really start to dent Solitaire's operation. Kind of our only hope on this one. 
Hello. You don't know me, but I know you. When I heard you'd been scooped up, I didn't believe it. I said to my guy, I said, no, no one would dare. They don't know who you are, do they? <laughs> nice. Your secret's safe with me. I'm calling you because I need a favour. I've been watching you. Not in a creepy way, but I've seen what you've been doing. The ripples, at least. You're making change. Change is good. You seem to be on the side of the angels. And I've got some angels who need your help. I don't know how up on English politics you are, but about 15 years ago, a kid called Rob Loxley made some changes of his own. He taught the nation how to steal from those who'd stolen his country. What he started in a little room in Nottingham ended with the downfall of Gisborne himself. A dictatorship destroyed by a teenager with an audience. I was just a teenager myself and Rob showed me something. I saw my calling. I saw a cause I could believe in and I joined his crew. We called ourselves the Merry and we were magnificent. We took down Gisborne and for a little while we were heroes but no man ever achieved anything alone, and that's especially true of bad men. Behind Gisborne stood the invisible ghosts, those whose power hid them from our little revolution, and those men came in the night, daggers drawn. I'm the only one left, the only one not dead or locked up, and uh, my power doesn't extend much further than making optimistic calls to people like you. Loxley's alive along with Scathlock and Joe, they're being held in Black Tower, a high security prison outside of Manchester. To get in, we'll need to do research, get details, access codes. I plan to mount a prison break. I know you have the people to put this together. So I'm asking you, I'm sort of begging you to be honest. Spymaster, can you help me restart this revolution?
still here. Good. Don't worry, the door stays open, but I'm excited that we get to keep working together, buddy. Uh, I'm Jim Ratio, by the way, and I think I said that earlier, but we rushed past it. And now it's gotten to that point where it feels awkward to be getting to know each other, but let's just push past the weirdness together and get back to it. Okay, new crew time. Incognito, masters of disguise. Nobody knows what they look like or how their impersonation tech works. They're kind of unknowable, really. I think that's kind of awesome. That's how they like it. They're a little awkward at parties about it, though. Yeah, I honestly don't know how they managed to confuse the cards either, but they like their secrecy. Right, four crews available now. That means you can take on some full-size jobs, and the road gets a little tougher now, but please, stick to it. We have to hit level 15 and get Alpha Division back online. 